Graduates are typically given gifts like cash for graduation, but tonight they're not the only ones rolling in the dough. 41 Action News reporter Tom Dempsey explains how graduations are becoming big business in Lawrence. One of our units is booked right now for four days and another one is booked for three days. For Airbnb hosts like Kim Wampler, this weekend brings plenty of business in Lawrence. Our bookings for the units this week were done last June. The University of Kansas graduation on Sunday leading to sold out units across the city. The days ahead following other busy times for hosts and guests who use the service. Weekends are booked most of the time. We have very few weekends that are that remain open. Airbnb tells us that hosts right here in Lawrence made a combined $1.3 million last year. But as it turns out, the service faces plenty of questions moving into the future. As it stands now, Kim Wampler says current regulations in the city for Airbnb bring an expensive and possibly complicated application process. $750 per unit, and then of course there, there will be the licensing after that. All this as the city weighs possibly changing the rules. One commissioner who spoke to 41 Action News says leaders could ban Airbnb in certain parts of Lawrence due to fears of its impact on affordable housing and neighbor complaints. It might be a little bit of a situation where we're okay with it, but not in our neighborhood. A service with a busy weekend ahead that could possibly see changes in Lawrence. I hope it just the attitude about it relaxes. Tom Dempsey, 41 Action News. Right now, the city's planning staff continues to research possible options for the commission to consider. A formal proposal to change the regulations could come later this summer.